What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna to be taking a look at the Balder SBL. Now what does the BL stand for? Let me take this off this SIG right here. What's up guys? This announcement is so secret that I had to do it undercover. Olight's having a Black Friday sale from November the 20th at 8 p.m. Eastern time through November 27th at 11.59 p.m. Eastern time. Tell all your friends, there'll be a link in the description below where you can go pick up stuff as this Balder S BL that'll be on sale, plus like art fields and things like that that I carry every single day. Well, I'll be on sale. And if by chance you find something that's not on sale, use discount code GEARRUNNER anytime to save 10%. Here comes the helicopters. Throw it into laser only mode and you can see right there it has a very intense blue laser now i don't know if you guys know this or not uh or if you've messed with lasers much red lasers are a little hard to see in sunlight green lasers and blue lasers do a lot better in sunlight than um just red lasers do uh, so if you're a big fan of lasers, you'll be a big fan of this. They also have this in the green. Um, either one of them is great. Um, I really like this blue though. It's a little different. It's easy to pick up. I mean, it's not hard to pick up at all. Um, I just really like the blue. It's just something different. I like it with this kind of coyote tan or coyote brown um, light right here. Now this light does have three modes. It has, it has a little switch. Now here you switch back and forth. It has light only. Then we have light and laser. And then we have laser only. And uh, it's just a great little light. I've got several of these Balder S's and uh, they just work great. I've used them, I've had them on tons of guns, I've had them in tons of videos, and they just keep working and keep working and keep working. Now this light has a max output of 800 lumens with a low output of 100 lumens. I do wanna show you this. It does have the quick detach right here to quick on and off of whatever pistol or rifle you may want to put this on. You can also put this on rifles as well. You can slide this back and forth to get to adjust it to the trigger guard, however you would like to have it. Um, and it does also come with a Glock rail and a 1913 or a Glock adapter and a 1913 adapter, which I have the 1913 one in because this does have a pick rail on the bottom of it. And then it also has Olight's proprietary charging system. And you can see right here, it fits perfectly on the SIG M18. Now, if you wanted to slide it away a little bit, you could just open that clamp, slide it, and slide it as far as you want to. You can get a plumb out here. I like mine to be a little closer to the trigger guard, so that's how I like mine right there. Again, this thing is pretty awesome. I ain't gonna lie. I like Olight's little Balder S lights. They're, they're really compact and really great little lights, and there are several holster companies out there that makes holster for these that you don't even have to take the pistol out of the holster to charge it. They've got like a hole on the side of it and you just throw the little magnetic charger in or on the back of the light while it's in the holster. And uh, it uh, it works perfectly. It just charges it. There's no, you know, it still covers the trigger guard. You're safe that way. And uh, you're ready to go on the next day if you've been using your light the day before. Um, so let me load some more rounds up. We'll do some more shooting with this. And uh, then we'll take a look at it in the dark and you can really see what the light looks like and what the laser looks like in the dark. Okay, one thing before we take a look at this in the dark so you can see what everything looks like. I do want to tell you, it does have like a momentary and a constant on. A long press gets you a momentary and a quick press will get you a constant on. And that works on any of the modes. If you just want the, the laser, um, you can do the same thing. Momentary, constant. Um, either way, you can just use the light. It works on all um, switch levels or adjustments on the back here. It works the same way on all of them. And uh, just look how little and compact this thing is. Again, I just love this color right here. Um, I've always been a big fan of FDE. It's one of my favorite colors. I actually ordered a pistol uh, yesterday and wanted FDE, but all they could get in was black. So I had to go with that. But FDE and 
like a coyote brown is one of my favorite um, color options that you can actually get. So uh, let's get to the dark and uh, take a look at what this will look like in the dark. You might be able to see the laser a little bit better um, in that video as well. All right, guys, I know a lot of y'all like to see this in like real darkness outside my house. I know I've seen it in the comment section, so I try to do this in each video. But here's 800 lumens. Um, again, I can kind of make out that fence up there at 100 yards, but I don't think that's really what this light's intended for. I think it's more of like, you know, really and truly it's a self-defense light, so it's going to be used probably with inside 10, 10 yards, 7 yards. Um, but you can really see if that tree right there is 25 yards. You could light that up. You could easily see if somebody had something in their hands at that distance. I mean, very easily. But this is more of a concealed carry self-defense style light. When I say self-defense, I meant like concealed carry. Um, so you're going to be using it at a closer range if you ever have to use it. Hope nobody ever does, but that's going to be the situation more than likely. Uh, if we swip, flip the switch, you can see that blue laser kind of lights up out there. I'll flip it one more time. You can really see the intensity of that blue laser. Um, that thing is crazy bright. When we flip it back over there again, you can see it right here too. All right, guys, what are the final thoughts on this? All right, I didn't put a ton of rounds through this because I've put a ton of rounds through a lot of Balder S's um, throughout my YouTube career, and they've all just worked and worked and worked. To be honest with you, I've never had a single issue with any Olight light um, that I've ever owned. I carry an Arcfeld every single day and uh, no issues at all. All of them just work. So, uh, I, I would not hesitate at all to put this on like an EDC gun or something like that and carry it every single day and uh, know that it would work when I need it to and my life actually depended on it. Um, I'm just that confident in Olight stuff after using them for so many years um, that I think they're really good to go. And don't forget they're having a sale starting November the 20th at 8 p.m. Eastern time through November the 27th at 11.59 p.m. Eastern Time, where you can get stuff like this, art fields, everything will be on sale. Go over there and check it out with the link below. And if you happen to find something that is not on sale, you can always use discount code GearRunner to save 10% off your entire order at any time. I appreciate you guys watching this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. I love you guys. We'll see you next time.